Hi, I'm Aura with the Mahal and Ross Real Estate Group at realestatetoronto.com and I'm outside of our new listing at 99 Burnett Avenue in the Young Shepherd area at West Lansing. We are literally a stone's throw from Young Street and I'm going to show you that behind me. There's Beecroft right behind me there and behind there is Young. We are surrounded by gorgeous custom homes. Um, and some of the actually finest homes. Look, at, we're on a nice quiet street too. I told you how close we are to Young. This street doesn't actually go through to Young. It turns into a crescent and wraps around into uh, Burndale. So what's really great too, when you see the kids on bikes behind me is there is little to no traffic on this street. If you're on the street, you either live here or you've made a wrong turn. I'm gonna show you some more stuff about this house. We're on a 50 foot lot for one. So in this neighborhood, that is uh, really amazing. That's, that's a premium lot. Um, we have seen some of the 50 foot lots in this neighborhood get split into 225s. We haven't seen it on this block of Burnett. However, we have seen it. And so I suspect we will see it again. I'm gonna take you into the backyard in just a second. Hi, I am in the backyard. We are again on a 50 by 117 foot lot. The only noise you're gonna hear here people cutting their grass because we have beautiful green lawns. Now again, we're about uh, 50 by 117, 118 deep. Doesn't sound deep, but what's really cool about these homes, I'm gonna show you, I'm in the backyard. You see that new home behind me? That's how far back it's gonna sit on the lot. So when we come back here, and if you were to build a new home, you're gonna see you still have a massive backyard for your pool and your kids and uh, the robins. I'm sitting here and there's robins around me. Um, there's the back deck. The house. Now this house is much larger than it appears. You actually have three bedrooms on that second floor, a fourth on the main floor, as well as a den, living room, dining room. And there is a walkout from the kitchen to that deck. cool so far right again we're at 99 Burnett Avenue in the Young Shepherd area I'm Aura Ross with the Mahal and Ross real estate group at realestatetoronto.com and we sell a lot of homes in this area so if you have questions about this one or another home or you're looking for something new or whatever it is you call us because uh, this is our home and this is where we work so again there's that backyard beautifully fenced on all levels 99 Burnett Avenue in the West Lansing neighborhood at Young and Shepherd. And I'm going to take you inside. Hang on a minute. Okay, so now we're inside. Hey guys, that's our closet. Nice big front hall closet. We have the original plaster walls, original hardwood floors. This is three quarter inch oak hardwood though that could easily be refinished uh, prior to moving in. It's a great job, no matter where you move, if you're buying an older home, it's a great job to do before you move in, refinish those floors, because once you're in, you don't want to do it. Beautiful thing about this home is it's flat ceiling. Look at that. And we've got the beautiful cornice molding. So uh, a lot of great bones here. This is one of the larger homes, as I mentioned to you when we were outside. Big, bright windows that has three full bedrooms upstairs. So again, we're at 99 Burnett Avenue in the Young Shepherd area at West Lansing. Look at the size of this kitchen. We don't see big family kitchens like this in our older homes. So um, this is just a great home if you are thinking about actually moving into the neighborhood and you aren't buying a $3 million new home, you can still get a fabulous, spacious, solid, solid, I mean, these homes are built like bomb shelters, um, in the neighborhood, and then, you know what, renovate it or update it at your own leisure. You don't have to keep up with the Joneses. There is your main floor, three-piece bathroom. Now, what makes this amazing is, remember I told you three bedrooms upstairs? Well, look at this other room. I already showed you a living room and a dining room and a huge kitchen. Now, look at this. Now, when these homes were first built, this was actually designed as the main floor master. And so for those of you that are worried about stairs or maybe have in-laws that want to come live with you, 
There's your closet. This family, of course, is using it as a TV room. Some people actually take that whole wall down, that whole wall with the closet and everything we're looking at, take it right down and open it right up. And now you've got a massive main floor family room. But again, if you need that fourth bedroom or a main floor bedroom for guests, family, someone who cannot do stairs. Remember I said you got your three piece bathroom on this floor, right? So you're all set. Guys, I want to tell you, this isn't a, a hugely staged home. These people are real. It's a real house. We're really living in it. And I just want to show you the space. So this, also on the main floor, guys, this is actually the den. So, beautiful French door. I wanted to show you that because they did a lovely job and it's beveled glass. Just adds a lot of charm. You know, you could do the same thing on this room. You could open the whole thing up. I've seen that done as well because this little main floor office, hey, this is the perfect office if you are now working from home, actually overlooks the backyard. You could do a walkout. Huh, wonder how much work we'd get done if we had a walkout from our home office. I could tell you, I would not get much done. Okay, so I think we've seen the whole main floor. Big main floor, right? Again, living room, dining room, Eden kitchen, uh, fourth bedroom, plus a den, and a full three-piece bathroom. All of that on the main floor, okay? So now we're going upstairs. Whew, I gotta get in some shape here, don't I? So just so you know, we're at 99 Burnett Avenue, and uh, there's actually access to a knee wall entrance there. And I just wanna show you, because every inch of this house is being used for storage. And I just think that's brilliant. So up here, we actually have three bedrooms. Again, we're not staged, we're packing, it's cool. It's all cool. Big, big bedroom. And I wanna point out again, beautiful hardwood floors up here. Closet, extra storage in the knee wall. Windows are all replaced. Like you could literally come into this house and do nothing, but it would be really fun to come in and just redecorate. Our family here has been here a long time, loving it. It's just time for them to move on. This is the smallest bedroom, the third bedroom. It's still adorable. Look at that, adorable. I'm showing you ceilings only because I want you to see that the home is in excellent condition. We don't have, uh, you know, if you walked into my real open house, you'd be looking at all of this. So I'm trying to show you everything I see. And then here is what uh, the other huge bedroom on the second floor. And we've got a king, king size suite up here. So just to give you a sense of the space, lots of storage. Okay. So three bedrooms on the second floor. Now, when these homes were first built in the late 40s and early 50s, this second floor actually was designed as a self-contained nanny suite and all of them had a roughed in kitchen in one of the walls. And I don't know if we've got one here, but that might be something for the next owner to find out. We're at 99 Burnett Avenue in the Young Shepherd area. C7. Toronto, Ontario. The schools here are Cameron Public School. I'll just look at this. So if you're doing dishes, this is your view. Oh, look at that. There's your view. Doing dishes isn't so bad. Cameron Public School District. The kids from there go on to the middle school of Willowdale, which is just up Senlac Road, and then can go on to Northview Collegiate which has three gifted programs. They have the cyber arts program, a gifted sports program, and believe it or not, the gifted math science. I'm taking you into the basement. We also have St. Ed's Catholic School, brand new school, gorgeous grounds. And that goes from JK all the way to grade 12. And we have the Prestige Private School that's located just north of us, walking distance, really. And that also is, I believe, now JK to grade six, but every year they're adding another grade to grow with the kids. We're in the basement. Um, I'm showing it to you because, again, if you were here at my open house, you'd be looking at it. We have a washer dryer area. We are forced air gas heat. And bear with me because I actually have to get some lights on for us here. 
tons and tons. I mean, obviously this family uh, is handy. <laughs> so they get tools. And so they're using it as a tool shop. They have not reported any excessive water coming in to this area of the house. They've actually found this home to be extremely uh, efficient and easy to look after. This is under your front porch cold cellar. But now they did finish one room down here because they have kids. And where do kids go when they get older and need a place to stay? They go to the basement. So this is awesome. So we've got our pot lights, a window. We are below grade. There's a window well there. You can see nice touches though. Beautiful built in. Nice big closet. And uh, yeah, cute as a bug's ear, they say. So there we have it. This basement, um, I'm trying to think. I'm I'm five feet in a bit. I'm going to, and I am stretching and I cannot touch the ceiling. So uh, we have, again, compared to other homes in the West Lansing and Willowdale area, we have great height in that basement. So I'm going to just turn this around and see if I can get back on the screen with you. I want to thank you again for joining us at 99 Burnett Avenue in the West Lansing neighborhood. If you have any questions at all, be sure to call us at 416-230-8500. We're on a 50 by 118 foot lot. We're priced at 1549. And if you have any questions at all, would like to go through virtually with us or plan for a live uh, showing, give us a call and we'll set that up. Again, I'm Aura with the Mulholland Ross Group, and I really look forward to seeing you in the neighborhood.